the last thing we need to do before we open up our images in the image ready program is we need to save them and it's important to note that our final product is going to be a GIF file, a GIF file extension and we need to save our new cut images in that same format so I'm going to select my first one and I will go up here to the file menu and click save as and it will open up a standard save menu and we're going to head and create a name for it and over here on the format we need to select the GIF format and now our file will become will be saved in the with the GIF extension and I'll go ahead and click save we'll go ahead and click OK to the next menu it's um, pretty much standard configuration and we'll also click OK to the next menu and now we have our image saved as a GIF file so we can go ahead and close this and the original file um, we will we already have our image in the in the GIF format is what we need so we'll just go ahead and click no and now we're left with our clown mask file and we're gonna go ahead and um, save that as well it was already in the GIF format I'm going to give it a new name just so I um, don't erase the original file I'll call it clown mask cut and I'll click on save and again hit OK and now we have two images saved in the GIF format we're ready to open up our animation program image ready and start our animation